What's going on guys? It's KG from the KG Method and today we're here with Mel. We're gonna go ahead and run through this leg and ab workout real quick. We're gonna start off with the barbell here. We're starting with some Romanian deadlifts and after that we're gonna do a single leg variation with either, um, with probably the dumbbell today. Uh, after that we're gonna do some Nordic curls. We're gonna put the barbell to anchor us down and we're gonna work out the hamstrings there. And then we're gonna finish off the legs with some calf raises where we'll be standing having the barbell on our back, and we're just gonna be lifting up, all right? After that, we're gonna do a little bit of abs, okay? So we're gonna do both, both exercises on the ground today. So the first one, lying on the floor, simple, doing leg raises, and then the second one, legs in the air, and we're gonna go up and we're touching the toes. All right, so for the first exercise, we're starting with the barbell Romanian deadlifts. We're gonna do four rounds, 15 reps today. Three more. Last one. Good. Good job. All right, so for the next exercise now, we're gonna go ahead and do four sets of 20 each leg of single leg Romanian deadlifts. So we're gonna make sure that we're just bending at the hips. So I like to always counter the weight in my hand, meaning if I'm working on my left leg, I'm gonna grab it with my right and then I'm kicking that leg back. Once my hips stop going back, I'm coming back forward. Whoops, and then leaning again. And again, I like to use a good amount of resistance, meaning a decent amount of weight, so that it could really help me get a good stretch. And normally when there's some sort of load, you're gonna have more balance. Just up high. See where you're starting from? You're not even straight here. There, now you're straight. So now you can. <laughs> the, the, you, you see here, you're not straight here. And then you went straight and then you went right back in and then you started your rep. Good, try to open up. You're doing good. But if you do it more, I bet your balance will improve. Like for one week, two weeks. Do it for two months. I just realized I've had this on me the whole time. And that would work per poorly if you worked like to 100% of your load. more. 
Last one, last one. Good there. Perfect. All right, so for the next exercise, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna do Nordic curls. We're gonna do it for about four sets of 10 here. Not gonna go too high rep because we wanna make sure that we still have control over the negative. Really burn out the hamstrings here. Five more. Last one, squeeze your hamstrings. There you go. Good. All right, so for the next exercise now, we're gonna move on to some calves. So we're just going simple standing calf raises. We're gonna do four sets, about 15 to 20 reps, okay? So remember here, I always like that we go all the way up, we try to squeeze our calves, and then we try to squeeze a little bit more, okay? So really spending your time there on the contraction. Go ahead. There. Three more. Two more. Last one. Good. All right, so we're finishing off with a little bit of abs here. So we're gonna start on the floor. We're doing some lying leg raises. And after that, we're gonna have the legs elevated up and we're going to reach up for the toes and we're crunching our upper abs while we do that, okay? Let's go ahead, this is a superset, so we're just going back and forth. A little bit of rest in between each. Four rounds. Uh, this is like 45 seconds. So you're gonna give out anyway, before the timer. Give me three, three more. Last one. Oh. All right, keep the toes up, keep the toes up. All right, give me 20 now. One, two, those are better. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. Good. Ten more. Breathe in. Go. Come on. Five more. One, two, three, four, five. Deep breath. One, two, three, four, five. You done. You done, Zo. All right. So, quick little recap of our workout today. We started off with some barbell Romanian deadlifts. Uh, we did about four sets of 15 reps there. After that, we did some single uh, single leg dumbbell RDLs, right? So same exercise, but now just one dumbbell in the hand. We did 20 reps for each leg there, and then we did a little bit of rest, and we did that four rounds as well. Actually, we did that for three rounds today, so that we saved a little bit of energy for some Nordic curls, and since we have to use our body weight there, we don't wanna be too, too, too exhausted. And normally, I'm not one to say like, oh, save reps in the, in the tank and stuff like that, but we don't have a hamstring curl machine or any machines here. So it makes a little sense for us to practice the exercise as well. 
or to program it earlier in your own workouts, right? If you're really bad at them or really want to get good at them. Um, so we did that for about four sets of 10, really controlling the negatives. After that, we did some standing calf raises. We did the barbell today. So she normally doesn't do the barbell, so we focused on going at a heavier load. And it said to do 20 reps, but we did it a little bit under that just to make sure that we were at a weight that was really heavy uh, so that we could you know, provide some stimulus to produce muscle, right? After that, we did a little ab superset. So we just did leg raises from the floor and then we kept the legs in the air and we went for some toe touches, really trying to focus on contracting our upper abs. We did three rounds there, but I would recommend that you would do about four, maybe even five. Um, and that was it. So thanks everybody for watching. Make sure to, uh, make sure to subscribe and check me out on all my other social media platforms. That's it. All right, peace.